What's happening, folks? Back with another reaction. Back with some more orchestral maneuvers in the dark, as well as Luca, who's probably going to jump up. And the next tune on Junk Culture 1984 is Apollo. It's an Olympian deity, the son of Zeus, and what is it, Leto? Also the twin brother of Artemis. I believe he's the god of many different things, archery, but also music, which of the things I'm aware he's the god of, I would expect that to be perhaps more relevant than the others. Of course, Apollo is also the name of a famous space program in the U.S. for NASA. I doubt that articulation would be relevant. Indeed, it could just be a word that in some way is used phonetically or in a more general sense and is not necessarily either, either of those references, but I would suppose if I had to guess, I would say it might relate to the Olympian and some conceptualized rendering of that mythological figure. So I'll see what I can pick up on a first listen. This is Orchestral Maneuvers in the Dark. The track is Apollo and it's from their 1984 album, Junk Culture. song, I will say I like the syncopated percussion, and yet, having said that, I feel like a lot of the tune feels like one of those early mid-80s 
extended mix sections where it gets into this sort of chopped up halting stop start type of syncopated rhythms and then goes back into the normal part of the song so yeah it felt experimental at least for most of the track more so than some of their other tunes certainly on this album i get it some of the early stuff and even the previous album dazzle ships maybe in particular had this really eccentric experimental feel this one felt somewhat like that although like let's say sillier which i don't use that in a critical way just in a this felt more insane more mad but ultimately the choruses felt a bit more regular song-like if that makes sense i didn't really catch all the lines and indeed the chorus itself was talking about what was it sell our souls to the man above or to the men above so it felt like maybe there was some either olympian or space related references being made but apollo seemed to be a woman at least if i'm reading that right several of the lines like having apollo in his arms in the bed and her lips and there were other lines about her or she so yeah it feels like it's less likely to be a reference to the mythological figure it's maybe just the name of some alluring and charismatic female character who i guess could be representative of a character type and not necessarily an individual person but it could also be the name of like a stage dancer who goes by the name apollo so either way it seemed to be a bizarre tune both lyrically and sonically again i do like that drum machine like halting again stop start sort of rhythm but it also felt like it was more let's make a weird tune that's not what people expect that's a bit outside the lines and not necessarily a catchy foot tapping you're gonna end up humming it when you're out somewhere because it's just it gets stuck in your brain an earworm as some people say so yeah it's an interesting track in that it feels more commercial than some of their earlier stuff and yet still out on their own like doing their own thing so i knew, i realize that's a bit contradictory but that's what it sounded like to me so in any case i'm curious as we go through this album as it relates to the record title junk culture the idea of something that's plastic and contrived and throwaway that after you use it for a little bit it'll be outdated soon and it'll be very much of its time it won't be timeless it won't be something that's seen as fine art or whatever but there clearly could be a wink of the eye and a bit of a chinky chinky cheeky smile to that kind of concept so it feels like maybe junk culture is a bit of a what's the right word uh, not sarcastic but a bit of a like clever slash again sort of wink type of usage of the phrase as i've gone through this album so far in any case luca i can't delay any longer i do have to get up so we'll see what she does here she's off let me know what you think and i will see you next time peace